Anne Hathaway and Steve Carroll, welcome to Love Film. Thanks. Or should I say Agent 99 and Max Smart. Now I have to say, in the film, it looks like you're both having an awful lot of fun. Anne, is it difficult to kind of keep a straight face working with Steve? Worse than difficult, it's impossible. <laughs> it's, it's, I've, I think the British have the best term for it, corpsing. And there's going to be about eight hours of DVD features, which is just Steve saying something brilliant and me laughing <laughs> really in the tape. We basically. all laughed a lot. We, I mean, it was one of those, uh, it was one of those situations where there were so many funny people, Annie included, that um, we would we would laugh consistently and on a <laughs> daily basis. So, yeah, and you can tell. I think you can yeah. tell when you see the movie that we're having a, a great time. Definitely. And as agents, there's a real sense of rivalry between you. Um, and there's one particular scene where you have a bit of a dance off. <laughs> um, I have to ask, who is the better dancer in real life? I'm definitely the best dancer. Sure? I mean, yeah, you would, would definitely you win a pants off dance off. I'm, I'm, <laughs> I'm, I am by far the, the more elegant and, and proficient dancer, even though Annie has had, what, 12 years of ballet? Not consistently. 12 and, and, years and of not, ballet. No. I've had 18 <laughs> years of jazz and tap. 18 years? And his his, we'll get, his <laughs> jazz, ha his jazz so, hands. I'm such a bad dancer. You I mean, I, I was fortunate to, to come out of the other end with, with my life. Um, <laughs> no, Annie's a great, great dancer. And... Uh, but we wanted they, we wanted that scene to look like we all, were all pretty good at it yeah, because we thought I it would be funny. Yeah, great. Yeah, it was fun. It was fun to do. <laughs> um, now there's lots of action scenes, running around, fighting. But Anne, you you do all this in five inch heels. Yes. It's quite impressive. Yes, I, I, I was quite impressed with me and my stunt double when I saw the film. Um, yeah, it's, it, you know, there are worse ways to make, to get a paycheck than have to run around in high heels. And thankfully, I, I you know, have good insurance so I can get go to a good chiropractor. <laughs> and my very last question to you, as secret agents, if you could spy on anyone for the day, who would it be? I would spy on my seven-year-old daughter at school. Why? Um, she's going into the second grade. Uh -huh. Um, I just, I would love to see what her day entails. Uh, you know, you hear reports oh, back. Um, and, and just to be a fly on the wall, just to see, because I think it would be so precious mm. and cute to see her interacting with her little friends and, and what they do and what they learn without, you know, her being aware Over of my presence there. there. Sure. Yeah. Um? I just think because he must be going through the most remarkable moment of his life, I would love to spy on Barack Obama. Um, you know, I'm, I'm really pulling for him in the upcoming election, and uh, I'm just so curious what yeah. the conversations must be about right now. I just thought this thing must be fascinating. Um, Anna and Steve, it's been oh. an absolute pleasure talking to you. Thank, Thank you very you. much. Thank you. <laughs>